Assalamu alaikum. Alaikum assalam wa Brother, my name is Rubina and I'm a teacher. My question is, you spoke about palmistry and fortune telling. My question is, if someone has done black magic on me and I want to undo it, am I permitted to do so? And if not, then what should I do? Are you permitted to do so? What means by so? Doing what? Undoing black magic someone else has done on me. Yeah, by going to the soothsayers. No, by reading Quranic ayah. Alhamdulillah, that is the cure. That's the remedy. See, this cure is the remedy. The Quran is the remedy. So if someone is affected by the black magic, you read in yourself. That's why prevention is better than cure. As a matter of fact, Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he taught us that every night before you go to sleep, you take wudu. And before you sleep, you collect your hands like this. And you blow. And you read, Qul Allah wa had. And you wipe. And you start from the end of the neck. Okay, the upper part of the neck. And you bring your hands like this. And you wipe your body. Three times. This is a protection. This is a protection. And you do this even for your children. And you read Ayatul Kursi. You read what? Ayatul Kursi. Allahu la ilaha illahu al hayyu al qayyum. And you read the end of Surah Al Baqarah. And you read Surah Al Mulk. So then you will be protected from the evils. And the Prophet ﷺ used to read on Al-Hasan and al Hussein As children he used to read in them. Ruqya. So read in yourself and, and your children, inshaAllah. May Allah protect our children and your children. Ameen.